Hello friends, welcome back to CAD practice. Today we are going to construct a 3D model of water tank in Autodesk Inventor software. So let's get started with today's tutorial. Go to new, take a standard part in millimeter and go to create. Now take a 2D sketch and select the XY plane. Here go to line command. First make a straight line. Skip. Now make the other profiles. Go to line command once again. Select here. Make a horizontal line and a vertical line. Now skip. Now go to dimensions. Give this height as 1700 mm. Double click. Okay. Now. Okay. Give this dimension as 925 mm and this vertical height as 1500 mm now zoom out ok so these are the final dimensions skip go to arc command take 3 point arc select this point and select this point now go to dimension Take here arc of radius of 1500 mm. Okay. So this will be the final sketch. Go to 3D model. Take revolve. Now select this axis for rotation of the profile. And press OK. Okay. Now we will construct a new plane over this curve profile. So from here we will select offset from plane, rotate the view, select this face, give dimension minus 1710 mm. Okay. So this will be 10 mm above the complete file and press OK. Now select this plane, go to create sketch. Here go to project geometry and project this outer circle. Take the line command. Make a line command from center. Skip. Select this. So as you can see it is in a track position. So go to coincident. Select this green center point and select this center point. Now this is fully constrained. Select this line. Go to offset. Select offset. Here offset will be 125 mm. And this side also. 125 mm offset. Skip. So this will be a total distance of 250 mm. Okay. Select this line. Make it construction. Go to arc command. Take center point arc. Select this center point. Select this point and select this point. Similarly, select center point. Select this point and select this point. Skip. Select this outer circle, make it construction. Now, as you can see, this is in moving direction. Go to coincident, select this point and select this circle. Similarly, select this green point and select this circle. Now, this is fully constrained. Now, go to circular pattern. Select this profile which we have made now. Go to axis and select this circle for axis of rotation. Here we will take a count of 2 and the angle will be 90 degree. Ok. Now press ok. Now go to polygon command. From here we will take polygon. Here we will take number of side as 4. Select this center point. Make a polygon. Skip. Now go to horizontal constraint, select this point and select this point. Skip. Now go to dimension, select this right click, go to aligned and this dimension here will be of 600 mm and escape. Now go to 3D model, 
extrude extrude all the profiles select so this and select this polygon profile okay now it will ask you the distance of extrude from here we will change it to to next so it will cover all the profiles up to next okay and here we will take join and okay now select this face or first you can hide this select this plane one right click turn off the visibility select this face go to create sketch go to circle command from this center point make a circle of diameter 425 mm go to 3d model extrude extrude it up to a height of 70 mm and okay okay now we will make this pattern profile over here so go to 2d sketch go to origin select the xy plane go to project geometry and project this outer profile and this bottom profile escape go to view visual style change it to wireframe now go to sketch once again take the circle command make a circle over here of diameter 50 mm okay go to dimension from bottom the center of the circle will be at a distance of 200 mm okay escape go to rectangular pattern select this circle go to direction 1 select this line here we'll take a count of 6 and the center to center distance will be of here will be 225 mm okay till here this pattern will come and okay now select this projected geometry yellow lines and make them construction okay now go to line command once again first click on construction now select the screen point and select here so construction line will be created now turn off this okay now go to 3d model take revolve front view select all the circular profiles okay now go to axis and select this center axis so it will make a revolve profile around the water tank go to view visual style change it to shaded with edges okay and press okay so this will be the profile here now we will give the fillet commands so go to fillet now here take a fillet radius of 70 mm go to edge selection select this bottom edge okay select this edge this this rotate similarly here select all the edges bottom side rotate the view select this this bottom this rotate here also all the three edges one by one and this okay and apply now take a radius of 20 mm go to edge selection and here select this edge select this the top edge this top edge rotate this edge this edge this top and this top okay now apply okay exit now go to shell command from here we will take shell and take the shell thickness as 5 mm okay for remove face select only the top face and okay now it will shell the profile from inside so this will be a complete hollow profile to check the hollow profile go to view from here we'll take quarter section view and select xy plane go to back view now you can see this is a hollow profile okay 
in this view you can see clearly okay now exit now from here and section view okay now we will make this here emboss of water tank for emboss go to 3d model now rotate the view again so this will be the front view now for emboss go to plane select this face and here we will select the xy plane okay select this new plane go to create sketch so this will be the front view now take the text command click here and write or first change the dimension to 75 now write water okay turn on the caps lock water tank okay and press ok now you can see or you want to increase the height i think the height is more so double click this and press ctrl a and here give the height of 100 mm enter now you can see it is coming down so drag this okay now move this from the side point okay now finish sketch now here you can see the text is not wrapped properly on the tank so from here we will take the emboss command select the sketch and here go to wrap to face and select this face okay now take a emboss of 5 mm here we have option emboss from face engraved from face and this is emboss oblique engraved from plane we have selected emboss from face and press ok so here now you can see this will be embossed from the face okay now select work plane 2 right click turn off the visibility now for appearance from here go to defaults right op for opal select opal and if you want to show this text differently go to emboss 1 from here we will take black color to make it more visible so take black cast okay so this will be the profile now go to view turn on the shadows and turn on reflections this is just for enhancing the view okay go to 3d mode so this was a basic tutorial to how to construct a 3d cad model of water tank in autodesk inventor software i hope you like the video if you do that please do hit like and subscribe the channel for more such videos thank you